Hello, I'm Mixed Mouse and Merman, and this is my little tiny Riley boy. Hey, boy at home. Um, so in today's video is day, um, I think it's 11. Let me double check. I think it's day 11 of the old kitchen install. I did video 10, I think. Uh, so today is day 11. There goes Nana. Away you go, Nana. It's fine. Nana. Every time. Yeah, you can duck. Um, today is day 11 and day 12. Um, but I couldn't really do a lot of recording in here because the toilet's been in and um, because we had, we had to stay off the floor, couldn't really do a lot in here. So yeah, this is day 11 and day 12. And today uh, we've made, or, or between the two days, is a serious amount of progress. Really, really, really pleased with how the kitchen has come on. Um, Mrs. P and I have been busy getting all the pots and pans and all the kettles, sugar, coffee, tea bag, containers, she wants it all uh, matchy matchy with the midnight blue stuff there. So we've got all new pots and pans. Riley's got a, a pumpkin. Um, <laughs> he's great, isn't he? Um, so yeah, lots gone on today and lots gone on yesterday. So if you have a kitchen being installed by Wix's, then if it's roughly the same sort of size as this kitchen, which is about a 10 20 by pumpkin. 25, then this is what you can expect if you're having a whole lot plastered, refloored the whole lot. So yeah, by about day 11, 12, um, this is where you'll be. Tomorrow is day 13, which will be final tile day. And day 14, um, Simon and his boys coming back in uh, to finish off. And so they've, they've done, uh, Matt, that's his name. So they've done the entire kitchen with a team of plumbers, um, electricians, tilers, plasterers, all done, completed within 14 days or thereabout. Um, there's still a bit of work to be done uh, afterwards, a bit of wallpapering and bits and pieces and a little bit of painting and what have you, but, but I can do that in my own time. No doubt Mrs. P want to get it done and finished, uh, but I can do that. So let's just get on um, and have a quick look around the kitchen and see what has been done. If this is your first time you're watching Mixed Mother Mother Man, hit the old subscribe button and whack the old bell. Ding. That way you'll be told next time we have another video. So without further ado, let's get down dirty. Let's check out Riley's little pumpkins and check out the progress on our Wix's what? kitchen install. Right, so forgive me for the noise, uh, but it is um, a working household and we have been living in a squalor for the past, um, <laughs> past, past two weeks. So Nana is busy in, a, in her little boudoir. She's hoovering and her door's just gone back on because the tilers have been in. So she's got her door back on. We had a little tiny sheet up against the door the other day. Simon's been in today and he's put all the corniches uh, around the uh, top of the cabinet. So that, that looks really, really nice. And they go pretty much level, all bar about a quarter of an inch to the ceiling. What do you think, Mrs. P? Are you liking it? Loving it. Loving it. The um, so corniches have gone in. The induction hob has now been wired up. That all works and been tested. And the cooker has just been burning off for about the past hour. Uh, that's brand new. Uh, that all works for a big double oven. Microwave is all working. It's all electric and what have you. Nice big double uh, microwave oven there. That's all good. Got a bit of woodwork to put into there and into there to finish that part off. The tile has been in. Uh, Kyle, his name is, nice young lad. Uh, Kyle's been in and he's put the, um, the white tiles up against this wall here. This is an extra we had on because when you open up your, your cooker, um, you'll get a bit of splash off the roast taters, see? So we've put that in there just so we can wipe that down easily. Um, it's also been tiled in here as well. No dramas there, that's all been done. Uh, need to check with Simon. I thought that was supposed to be tiled too. I need to double check that. Yeah, I need to get on the side about that. Um, Carl's also done all round by the bottom of the window, all round by the edges there. That's all been done and through under the sink. That's all been done and siliconed up. Uh, that looks really, really nice. And it's also done over here as well. That's all been done as well. Again, looks really, really nice. Um, all the floor is nearly done. Uh, we're nearly there. We've got two pieces to put in here um, to finish that bit off. And we've got some fresh holes to put in, but that's all been done there. And we are not going for skirting boards. We're going for upstands, which is um, uh, the same tile on the floor, which should be put around uh, around like your skirting boards are, but that would be, they're called upstands. That's all done or nearly done. Going around this way, excuse me please, Riley boy, the flooring's all been done. Uh, what's that in there? That's Pip, that's for cat's cupboard. Cat's cupboard and dog cupboard. That's where Pip's food is in there. Yeah, that's where Pip's food is, lovely. Um, around here, all the flooring's been done. Um, that's all finished off, just needs to have the upstands and thresholds put on. 
New plug socket been put in down there and updated because it was um, the old fashioned one hanging out the wall. All the plug sockets have been done, tested, and uh, they are all now working. And they're white for now. I will be changing those for an updated version later. Peninsula is finished. Um, just got to have um, this, uh, this trim has been added today and also been added on the side here as well. And we've also um, just purchased, from, these are from the range, uh, some nice black bar stools, which have a perfect height, nice and comfortable. I'm gonna buy two or three more of those just so we can put them up in the loft for around Christmas time. You know, bake the sandwich and what have you. We can get more around the peninsula, but put them in the loft out of the way. And uh, when we have guests come around, we can just bring more stools down. That's the idea. A bit more flooring to be done here. That'll be done tomorrow. And then once that's been done and the upstanding's been put around the sides and all around by the, uh, around by the, fire, uh, around by the, um, the uh, chimney breast here, all the grouting on the floor will then be done and all the grouting all the way around on, um, on the side there as well. So that, that's coming. Uh, Riley, can you turn the, um, the under cabinet lights on, please, for me? Not that one, no, one across. No, keep going. Yeah, that, yeah turn it on, yeah, bang. Yeah, so that's the under counter light has now gone on. Thank you, Riley boy, my, my little assistant. That's okay. <laughs> so we've got under counter lighting that's now awesome. on, which is, which is lovely. Amazing. Uh, that will then set the mood there. And Nana, Sorry. try and do a video. Um, found yeah, a bowl uh, and there. So if we turn the main lights off now, you can now see that that sets the mood just lovely now in here. It looks really, really nice. It's amazing. And also we've got another light down here, which would be, um, where's that light switch? That one there. Oh, that's not that uh, yeah, 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 it's fine, yeah. Uh, that will do all the under lighting for the, for the plinth lighting. So it's all in place. It's just got to be um, put into place. So we've got um, one here, one, here. Uh, one there. Uh, one there, one there. I think there's two or three there. There's two there, one there and one there. One here. There'd be, uh, I think it's only uh, yeah, two on that one. And then we'll have um, one on that cabinet and there's just enough room, just enough room to do um, one more uh, underneath there as well. So that'd be nice. And then we've also got um, one here and one here that's already wired and done. So tiny. And there'll be one more in there. So yeah, plenty of plinth lighting going on, which is lovely. Um, let's turn the big lights back on, turn them back off for now. Um, we've got a bit of decorating to do yet, a bit of sanding to do up on the main, up on the main lights and what have you. Um, a bit of sanding down and uh, painting there. And then the whole lot's got to have uh, a proper coat of white because that's to have the plaster paint on it. I've got a bit of repair work to do on the ceiling because we had a leak from when the uh, a water burst. You get some some white some white stain block up there, um, and there's another patch just over here we've seen creep up, just there. So another bit of white stain block on there as well. That's got to be done as well. And then painting all the way around uh, has all got to be done. Uh, new door's got to go onto here. Come that on. is out in the conservatory which is uh, that one there. And then we've got the two doors have just turned up for the fridge freezer. They turned up about an hour ago. And this one here has just turned up. Uh, Simon's fitted that one for now, but that's gonna be uh, joined together. So those two will be joined. And then we've got another cupboard up the top to put in. And all the corniches have been putting up there as well. It looks really, really good. Really, really tight. Just, just look, at, look at the workmanship. Look okay. at the workmanship, look at the joints. You know, he really has, oh, Simon is, is, is a master. He's a master craftsman, he really is. The, the amount of time he spends just trying to figure it all out. So, so that's where we are at the moment with the kitchen install um, for day 11 and uh, day 12. Um, thank you, Nana. Um, just waiting to have um, Simon in tomorrow in between. He's either coming tomorrow or he'll be in Friday. I think he's gonna try and get in tomorrow to do a little tiny bit if he can. Um, look. There's mummy, yeah. Well, um, recording. That's fine. Um, just to try and do a bit, but I've got a feeling my tyler has got enough to get on with, so I've got a feeling he's, he's gonna lead Kyle to do, to do what he needs to do. And he's got all that work to do um, uh, on Friday. And by end of play Friday, uh, we should be done. <laughs> Um, so I'll bring you back tomorrow um, if I can and then the last day Friday for close and then that should be it. So yeah, kitchen all done very nearly. 
um, <coughs> including uh, iconic background washing up noise uh, to, to, my, to, my, to my right here, by my lovely wife. Um, and there you go again, <coughs> thank you. Um, um, Mom! So there, that, that's where we are. Mrs. P, you're happy, aren't you, darling? Yeah, yeah, she, yeah she, she's very happy indeed. Um, we're just nearly there. Once the tumble drive's gone in place, washing machine's all in place, um, that'll make it even easier. I've had to pull the machine out again tonight just so we can get some washing done. And uh, yeah, we're good to go. So yeah, we really are, really are excited. Um, it's come on so well in such a little time today. It's been manic. It's been a manic day here. So with electrician and the son both in together, dodging around each other, getting the work done. It's been absolutely manic. But we're getting there. Uh, I think we're having one more takeaway tonight, are we, babe? Yeah, takeaway tonight uh, because the cooker is up and running, um, but we've got no pots and pans and bits and pieces as of yet. We've got to go and pick them up in a little while and what have you. So, but by tomorrow, an interval weekend, uh, we'll be back to doing home cooked moods, uh, home cooked food. So that'd be good. So yeah, really, I'm pleased with um, the Wix's install. If you're lucky enough to have someone like Simon and his team come into your kitchen. You're not going to be disappointed. He, the man absolutely generally does care. Um, he messages me day in, day out when the other teams are in to make sure I'm happy and make sure they're okay and the work's been done properly. So, yeah, all good. So, there you go. Quick little video there for you of the kitchen install for day 11 and day 12. And I'll bring you forward for day 13 and 14 coming soon. And that'll be the whole process of um, how to have your kitchen installed via the Wix's installation team. If I saw a video called Mixed Mother's and My Man, then hit the old subscribe button and whack the old bell. That way, you'll be told next time I upload another video. I'm looking forward to seeing an episode of Mixed Mother's very, very soon. But until then, guys and girls, much more importantly, take care of you.